hello guys good morning today i'm gonna take you with me to tamale in the northern region yeah and i'm really really looking forward for it i'm super super excited and it's actually my first time going to the northern part of ghana so i'm really looking forward for it and we are going with a friend hanan he is from the northern region but he doesn't live there but um he has a two weeks um, business trip and he will be driving that means road trip so guys this is gonna be fun and i'm really really looking forward for it now the clock is uh, almost 5 30 and the taxi driver is here he's hi Rizdom. <laughs> so he's going to take us and then we will meet our friend on a halfway and join his car so guys let's hit the road okay so guys we are here now and i'm super super excited <laughs> it's gonna be fun so we are waiting for our friend now we, the driver just dropped us off so, uh, our friend is here okay okay so guys now we have made a stop at the Linda Doors. <laughs> I'm actually hungry. I normally don't have any breakfast, so we are going to see and get ourselves some food. we just arrived here at the molly park in our chalet i will make a video about it the room tomorrow morning i'm simply too tired to make a video now we're going to stay two or three days here at the molly park and then the rest it will just go to tamale good morning guys good morning good morning how are you all doing i hope you are fine i'm good um last night when we arrived we had our dinner and we went to bed quite fast around i think half past eight to nine we were so tired i have had a good night's sleep and relax and this morning we will have to go to the reception um we will have a morning tour that is one hour with one of their guards now it's um 6 20 so i have made myself ready and then when we back we will have our breakfast but i would like to take you guys around here so you can see the place that is where we are staying that is the street that leads to the restaurant the front here is the entrance to where we are and on the right side you can see people are walking there that's the car park all these buildings you see here are the chalet for the guests okay good morning so here is the restaurant they have the bar on there they have the swimming pool here here is the view to the park where the swimming pool is it's really beautiful so our chalet is in the end of those buildings here on the left side okay so guys i'm gonna give you a tour in our room where we are staying in the molly park we are in d5 chalet um, so here is the room you have a small table here and a wardrobe there is a, a picture of an elephant i guess that represent here there is a tabletop small fridge two sofas and that's the bed and here is the toilet the sink over there and the shower tub and here leads to the balcony guys this is the back side of our chalet the balcony with an incredible view i can see like six elephants swimming down in the water they are cooling off their body here is amazing guys to have a view like this gosh it's like to live in heaven <laughs> this morning there was a lot of baboons around the balcony here but they are away good morning, good morning. 
Yeah, it's a Oh, that's good. <laughs> Hi guys, meet my friend Hanan. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> he was the one we came with yesterday. He has been very helpful. Yeah, he's from the northern region, but uh, he doesn't live there. But he has two weeks business trip, right? Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> see you guys. We are ready for the tour. It's soon seven o'clock, so we are going to hit the tour and the safari. Okay, so guys, we have walked here to the reception at the Molly Park. That's the reception there, and people are already sitting, as you can see. And the car, that's the safari cars. You sit on the top, you rent, and then you go for the drive. But we are taking early morning walk. Um, I believe it's an hour or two. I'm yet to find out. So I'll just go and join them sitting over there, and then it should be seven o'clock. I guess we leave in a few minutes. Hi guys. Hi. So we have Saidu here. Yeah. He is gonna be our tour guide yes. for the walking safari. Yes. So let's hit the safari now. Wow. There are two big elephants. This is beautiful guys. See this they are beautiful. Wow. Are they male or females? Can you tell that? Yes. Yeah. Around here, only the male ones that come here. In Ghana here, we have two types of elephants. Okay. We have the savanna elephants and the forest elephant. These are the savanna elephants. Mm. Normally, they are quite bigger than the forest elephants. Yeah. Okay. And then the, the forest ones are quite aggressive than the savanna elephants. There are more elephants coming to join the others in the water. It looks pretty small, but if you get closer, it's bigger. Okay, so guys, the elephants are out from the water, so we are approaching to see them well. And now it's spreading sand on the body, protecting itself from the sun and the fly. He said there's a stream across it so we can get closer. Yeah. So guys, you can see where the elephant is standing in between us. There's supposed to be a stream during the rainy season but now it's dry so the water has dried out i believe because of the dry season there are not many animals we are seeing at the moment and saidu the tour guide said if we come around um, April, June, July when the raining season is there you see a lot of many animals many elephants in groups with their babies or what do you call it coming in group to the forest here but uh, unfortunately we are not seeing any many animals as I was expecting so I'm sure I would have to come back again during the raining season because it's so beautiful here guys uh, it's very beautiful you see most of the trees their leaves has fallen out and it's totally dry so the reason why is when it's the dry season the animals are not around it's like do they travel yeah. far out to find water yes. and stuff to find uh, food you know yeah some area like this normally it do burn it do burn very fast like yeah. november we do early burn mm, so bush burning bush burn so they do found the grasses the new the, ones okay. and goes there mm. Guys, we can see a lot of antelope, but they, are, they keep running away when they hear our footsteps. Can you see, guys? Oh, that's the elephant poop. It's all dry out. <laughs> wow, it's pure grass. Okay, that's the poop of the antelope. Normally, the intestines. Ah, the grass, they, they, yes. not they yes, take it out. They will just use the intestines for once they are fresh. Mm -hmm. So they can feed them. They can feed the uh, intestine with the poop. Inside. Yeah. Mm. And okay. use for soup. <laughs> so we were discussing about the antelope and the grass cutter poop. They use for soup. Have you ever tried uh, antelope 
poop or grass cutter poop for soup before comment down below i would love to know so guys we are finished with the walking safari for the day we are now going back but i think in the afternoon in the late afternoon we will take the ride safari too so we ride around in the park so now we are going to have our breakfast okay so say we said in the afternoon we will be driving and we'll be, we'll be going deep in the in the park so deep down in the forest someplace okay so I will. Yeah, I don't know. Will you be the one to say do? Yes. Will you be the one to take us in the, or maybe a different person will be on the shift, I guess. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Whether I will be. Oh, there. different person. Yes. No, it doesn't matter. Sometimes, if I, if you come and I've gone out, yeah. maybe different, different person, person can take you. Okay. Yeah. So then, we thank, you so you thank you so much. Thank you so much. So, <laughs> thank you. See you. Later. So bye. So guys, we can see two big elephants around where we are staying. They are here to eat. They're pretty big. Guys, this is amazing. This huge big elephant is around our chalet. Hi guys good afternoon we have had our lunch and then we were tired so we came in to take a nap and we want to join the afternoon safari which is 3 30 so now the clock is 3 10 we will just walk to the reception and then we take the afternoon safari which is um right safari the car safari so we'll be driving through around the molly park in the morning the one we took was a walking safari so now we want to experience the ride safari okay so guys we are getting ready for the ride safari um in the morning i forgot to tell you guys the walking safari is 10 to this for Ghanaians and foreigners is 20 to this and then we rent a safari car that is over there if you can see with the top so we'll be, we'll be sitting on the top and it's 100 cities per hour so i guess if you want two hours and three hours is the maximum they can go oh yeah, guys we can see a big elephant here We had to like a king reverse yeah. from the <laughs> elephant because we could not drive beside it. We don't know what they can do. So we are reversing and diverting our path to take a different a different direction. It's almost the same color as the ground. Guys, can you see the crocodile? Yeah. Guys, can you see them? The name again? Waterbok. Waterbok. Okay. These are the female ones. <laughs> they are very big and high. Oh. No, we haven't seen this one. There are a lot of elephants here. If you see one, you can see the other one. Mm -hmm. There are many other ones. Hi guys, good morning. Today is our second day here staying in the Molly Park and it has been amazing so far. Yesterday was fun and so today right now we are going to have our breakfast is soon seven o'clock 
and then the plan for today is to hire a local tour guide to take us through outside the town in Moli Park. The plan is to visit a Larabanga Mosque, visit um, the Kanun Safari, mud houses, and then where they do the shea butter. Then I think we will take a walk later in the evening and then just relax. So tomorrow probably we will check out from here and go to Temali. This is what we call a puffer fish. Puffer fish? Yes. Uh, wow, I've so round. It. Yeah, so round. Uh, <laughs> I hope you've seen it before. I've seen it on this. Yes. Yeah. This is the scale of a hatibis, mm -hmm. the second biggest antelope we have in Moli National Park. Okay. Then the almighty baboon scale. Mm. Yeah. It, it looks quite close <laughs> to a human skull, right? <laughs> oh, yes, yeah, quite yeah. close yeah. to a human skull. It looks quite star. close. That is the ear of the elephant. Yeah. Whoa. So, this elephant we have been seeing, that's the ear? Yeah, that's the ear. Wow. And we use the skin to design the map of Moli National Park. Mm. That's the skin. Yeah. Okay. That's the wow. I want to feel the skin. Mm -hmm. you see how hard wow, it's so hard. You walk and take uh, part of the skin to design map of Ghana. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Wow. yeah, I was thinking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then map of Africa. Africa. Yes. Oh, from this elephant. <laughs> from this elephant. Yeah. This that is very creative. <laughs> <laughs> now have the almighty scar. Wow, that's the skull of the elephant. Wow, this is huge. Guys, yes. that is the skull. That is quarter tax of it. Yeah, a quarter. The quarter tax of it. Yeah. Wow. You can lift it and have it. It looks like wood. Yes, that's a real skull. Gosh, it's heavy. It's heavy. Wow. Every part of the elephant is heavy. Hey, That's seriously, quarter, wow. Quarter, quarter, quarter. Mm, a broken part. A broken part. What they are killing them for. By the way, my name is Fatal. And this is our community called Narbanga. And it's a small Muslim community. Living 4,000 to 5,000 people, 100%. We call Muslims. And actually, the more that you can see here, this must be one of the oldest mosques in Ghana. And it seems to be one of the oldest mosques in West Africa. It will record around 1421. Currently, today that we're standing here is the most is 600 years now. And the founder that who put up this Larbanga mosque here, he was migrated from southern Arabia in the town called Medina. Medina. Yeah, yeah, this is a capital yeah, town yeah. in yeah. southern yeah. Arabia. Yeah. And this man was serving us as a spiritual consultant to a certain warrior known as Smaila Ndu Rejakwa. This Smaila Ndu Rejakwa, he is the king of the Gonjas, and we are in the Gonja land, our district capital town, which is the Mango. You know, like Ghana, we have some extended family called Gonjas. Gonja, yeah. So, Jakwa, he is the king within the Gonja people. He is a great warrior. During the olden days, he used to go around most of the African countries. Okay, so guys, we are here now at the Magnori village. We are about to take the canoe safari. Hello. <laughs> What's your name? My name is Latif. 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 Okay, hi Latif. Yeah. Hi. yeah. So this is the uh, Moli River. Here we are in the nation. guys good morning um, so we are finally done with our stay here at the Molly Park so far it has been amazing beautiful nature serene environment it has been so nice staying here 
um, we did stay three nights here at the Molly Motel and we are waiting for our driver to go to the Tamale maybe we might spend a day or two in Tamale to explore a little there but so far it has been incredibly amazing it has been so nice here at the Molly Park the place is beautiful um, elephants come here close to where we are staying and the baboons beautiful colorful birds oh it has been so good guys it's really really lovely so you can also come here and check it out So guys, now I'm here um, in Temale in a hotel called Regal. That's where we are staying. And I cannot leave Temale without um, eating the teaser, the teaser fee, you know. So I just got it here, and you can take a look at how it looks like. Um, Hanan, what is teaser even made made of? Corn. Corn. Okay. Sometimes you have millet. Millet. Like maize. Okay, yeah, so it made. It's, maize. it's called tiozafi. It's tiozafi. made from maize. Some can be made from millet too as well. And I have my soup here with a little stew with chicken. Very slimy. I love this food, guys. So the soup is called ayoyo. Yes, the soup is called ayoyo. So yeah, it looks very delicious now. And so let's have a taste. <laughs> okay. Mm, it tastes really good, very nice. <laughs>